Lizzie, and thank you so much for all of the kind words and congratulations I got on my other video about um, my dad's passing and the news about our coming up baby boy in the spring, um, 2023. So yeah, it just really was heartfelt and really uh, was comforting from hearing from everybody. I really appreciate it. I have my huge Bath and Body Works, was it the $12.95, $12.50 something candle sale um, that they had? Surprisingly, I wasn't expecting that sale. I had just gotten my coupon in the mail for 25% off and I was like, you know what? I'm just going to use it because this deal cannot be beat and you can use a code with it. It brought them down to like $9 and change. So really great deal. A bunch of scents that I was hoping to get, especially um, I unpacked them because I wanted to make sure none broke. And especially for like these scents with the special glass lids, these are $29.50. So the fact that all of these were like also the $12.50 50 sale um, with the 25% off made it a great deal to pick these up now. So here is one of them. It is Frozen Lake with the beautiful blue glass star lid. Lavender leaves, cool eucalyptus, juniper berries. I was never a big Frozen Lake fan before, but um, I think in the past year, I've really grown to like it. It's a nice, fresh, clean scent. A little manly, but it's not too bad. It's just mostly like clean and like refreshing when you burn that. Um, another one is the Cedar and Suede in the beautiful green. Soft Cedar Warm Incense Velvety Suede. This one I'm not a huge fan of. Yeah, I get too much of the incense, the, the cedar, the... No, I'm just... Not my cup of tea. Winter candy apple in the red. Red apples, crisp pear candied oranges. Just a nice, sweet, juicy apple scent. Um, I wish they kind of came out with some new scents instead of some repackages in this uh, jar style, but that's okay. And the last one is Fireside in the nice white clear smoke cedar fresh clove bud warm embers it's very smoky yeah <laughs> i don't know sometimes i think um with the pregnancy like some of these scents i'm just like oh my gosh gag <laughs> cannot do um one of the other special candles that was also during the sale is the perfect christmas and it has this lovely Santa top that's ceramic. Um, I love that they're doing these special lids um, like they did with the Spooky Cider Lane at Halloween. And um, this nice pretty white jar. Fresh cut pine, cinnamon sugar, toasted marshmallows. These are $32.50, so can't beat that price. I actually got two of these. And um, I think it was Eric that was also saying it smells weird. Is, I don't remember exactly what he was saying. He thought maybe it was the lid. I don't know. I, my lid smells okay. It smells like what I think it just smelled like pine and um, what, what did I say? Pine, cinnamon, sugar, toasted marshmallow. Like I get the pine no and the cinnamon, but when I smell the candle, it just smells different than last year. I don't have, I can't find last year's to compare it, but it, it smells like different than I remember. I feel like last year it was more like red hot cinnamon and that was very strong and prominent, but maybe I'm just like remembering incorrectly. So yeah, I don't know. I think it is different in this star style. Um, like I said, I got two of those. I had to get a peppermint hot chocolate, such a good scent. And I love the kind of jar style with the mint green and the like snow ice crackling. Sweet Peppermint Silky Milk Chocolate Sweet Cream with this nice lid. Mm. You just get that peppermint, but that nice soft chocolate, milk chocolate undernote. Ugh, I need multiples of these, but since I have a couple from last year, we'll probably wait until candle day. White Woods and Peach. Juicy Peach Soft White Woods Cinnamon Stick. Yeah, this definitely just seems like, I don't know, is it Peach on Earth or one of those other peach scents um, repackaged? It's a juicy peach. 
I don't really get a wood note at all. Mm -mm. Or cinnamon. No, I get definitely that juicy peach note first and foremost. Applewood and clove. Rich applewood, warm clove, white birch. This also just smells like a repackage of some fall scent. I, I can't put my finger on it. It's, it's nice. You get definitely get the cinnamon. It's not the red hot cinnamon. It's more like the, you know, craft store potpourri type cinnamon. With a little bit of that apple sweetness. So it's a good scent. Just I feel like it could be something that we already had before. Midnight snow in the blue. Juniper berry cedar wood soft lavender. I do like the scent a lot. It's um, The lavender isn't sharp. It's just a nice soft lavender. And it's just so fresh and clean smelling. Yeah, the cedar wood and juniper doesn't really bother me at all. It's very like a nice blend together. They had this last year, I think, too. Land of snow. And the nice ornament lid. Snowy cypress, ice juniper berries, frozen oak moss. I think this is new, is it? Yeah, because the Land of Sweets is like the sugared pomegranate, but this doesn't have any other like scent that I was titled after. It smells good. It's not like one I need multiple of. Yeah, it's a little manly. Um, Yeah, you definitely get the tree, but it's, it's kind of just cologne in my opinion. I love this kind of packaging with the cute little wraparound. So this is Bright Christmas Morning. It came out last year as the tree lid. Uh, ripe red berries, blood orange, crisp apple. Yep, it kind of reminds me of champagne toast. Um, like that. Twas the night before Christmas. I just think that's so cute. It is Santa's Fresh Baked Cookies, a warm mug of milk with dashes of cinnamon and nutmeg. I got the single wig in my last haul, and I said how it's definitely different than Cookies with Santa. Yeah, you definitely get the creaminess and the vanilla. A little bit of the baked cookies, but it, mostly just the vanilla creamy milk quality to this, to this one. Cinnamon sugared pecans. I like the plaid and the tree. This also has the tree lid. Warm cinnamon toasted pecans brown sugar. Mm, it smells so good and like warm. It does smell like just warm cinnamon baking. I don't really smell pecans. I guess it just has kind of like a toasty nutty quality, but yeah, it's definitely a nice baked gourmand candle. And here's Land of Sweets, which is just sugared pomegranate. Um, so cute with the lollipop. I wish they did come out with like a scent for this called Land of Sweets, but that's okay. Sugared pomegranate, pink grapefruit, sparkling bergamot. And you do just get that grapefruit, like kind of bitter, sharp scent. I love grapefruit scent. So this is a win in my books. Mm. Ah, fa la 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 latte beautiful green. I heard definitely some disappointing reviews about this one. Shot of espresso, sweet vanilla foam topped with warm cookie crumbles. It sounds amazing, but people are saying it has like no throw. Yeah, you, you definitely smell the caramel sweetness with a little bit of the cookies um, and a little bit of the like coffee, but not like it's not like Paris Cafe with the cinnamon spice vanilla. It's just it's not caramel brulee latte. It's, just, it's definitely different because it definitely has that cookie note. But it's disappointing that everybody's saying it's a dud. <laughs> but I like the packaging, so it's definitely for my collection. Here is Tis the Season. So another repackage. We already read notes for that one. Oh, and then... This one I had to show, it came in this box, you know, the one that you have to pry open and there was no lid to it. I've never received a candle that had no lid like anywhere. <laughs> so they just put it in the box, sealed it and forgot to put the lid on. It's iced winter balsam. That's okay. I have plenty of lids lying around. This is frozen eucalyptus, sugar pine, fresh balsam. It's kind of light, 
but I do like it. It just, I don't know, smelling these Christmas tree scents makes me want to just burn them all, have my Christmas tree up and uh, sit around it with the fireplace going. But yeah, so that is definitely getting me in the holiday mood. A couple of rewards I used, I did pick up the bright Christmas morning shower gel because that wasn't out yet during the body care sale that I could find. Um, and then some single wicks that were, I think, online exclusives. So I did get the blush poinsettia, which is rose petals, green ivy, sweet marshmallow. And I love that that has the pink wax. There's a few of these that are all pink. I think I got them all. This came out last year at Candle Day. And I just, I really do like this scent. It's like a nice floral, soft. It's not like... I think if you don't like florals, you might still like this. Um, it kind of reminds me of um, Pink Petal Tea Cake, that rose floral note. Pink Fairy Gumdrop. Not a fan of this scent, but, you know, it was online exclusive and it was so cute with the pink wax. It's like, okay, maybe I'll get it. <laughs> Sparkling Sugar Berries, Pink Cotton Candy, Sprinkle of Fairy Dust. No, it just it smells plastic and like a plastic doll to me. Mm-mm. And last, Mary Mimosa. I, this one is just too adorable with that turquoise tree. Uh, sparkling champagne, red apple slices, ice sugar crystals. Mm, it's just like a nice juicy apple. And it does, yeah, have that kind of bubbly note. So it does remind me of champagne toast a little bit too. But that comes, this comes out every year. And yes, so that was my huge haul for the 12, I don't know, what, is it 12.95? I'm sorry, I keep getting it wrong. Um, 12.95 with the 25% off. So yeah, I think I got a really good deal. There's still a few from the holiday stuff that's out now that I'm missing that I don't know, either I'll get during the next candle sale or I could wait just a candle day. Who knows? Um, but thank you guys so much for joining and please subscribe if you have not yet. And I appreciate all of you. Thank you. Take care. Bye.